Hey guys, Joe here, back with another Rust video. Today I will be teaching you how to add a custom crosshair to Rust, but also take note that it also works on any game that can be played in windowed or borderless windowed mode. I know that this is controversial as some of you might see this as cheating or that it gives some players an unfair advantage, but people having custom crosshairs is always going to happen, regardless of what the devs do. The simplest crosshair done by players is simply putting a dot in the middle of their screen using a dry white marker. At the other end of the spectrum, some fancy gaming monitors can actually overlay custom crosshairs. Both of these are impossible to detect and prevent by any game developer without completely overhauling hipfire mechanics. If you disagree with the use of crosshairs then that's completely fine. Let us know in the comments what you think Face Punch could do to prevent the use of them, as watching this video will show you how easy it is to set up your very own crosshair. Before we begin, let me remind you that this is undetectable by cheat prevention systems because it does not alter the game files in any way. In other words, this will not get you banned. For step 1, all you need to do is download both files provided in the description below. One is the overlay program itself and the other is a simple custom crosshair picture which will be overlaid in the centre of your screen. Once you have them both downloaded, extract the overlay program to a safe place on your computer. For this demonstration, I'll simply put it on the desktop. Next, create a folder on your desktop called Crosshair and move the Crosshair picture file inside. Once you have done that, open up your new overlay program. If it opens with a Coca-Cola logo in the corner, then you know that it's working fine. Find the green icon for it in the notification area and click Settings. From there, you want to point it at the Crosshair folder that you made earlier. Once you now have the crosshair image shown in the corner, click the location tab, then click center and make sure both offsets at the bottom are set to zero. This makes sure that the picture is dead center in the middle of your screen. You can use the offset buttons at the bottom to adjust the crosshair position slightly if you feel that your bullets aren't going where you want them to. Next, click the size tab and scale the crosshair down until you're happy with its size. You can now go ahead and minimize the overlay program and open Rust. To make sure that the overlay is perfectly in the middle, all you need to do is bring up the white dot that Rush shows whenever you look at an item. Easiest way to do that is to throw something on the floor, then line the crosshair up with the white dot using the offset buttons that I mentioned earlier, and then you should be good to go. It may take a little bit of tweaking so you're completely happy with the crosshair. You can always swap out the crosshair picture for your own, just make sure that when you make the crosshair that it's transparent. And with that, happy hunting!